Hello, everyone. If your days are insanely busy and you are working within Smartsheet and collaborating with a lot of different people in a lot of different sheets, and you don't have time to go in each day and review what has changed, I want to teach you a very simple and effective tip so that you can turn on a feature and it's going to highlight those changes for you. I'm Candace Porter, the founder and managing director of a company called Effective Flow Connections. If you are viewing this channel for the first time, I would appreciate it if you like this video and if you subscribe, especially if you're interested in all things project management. That's what this channel is dedicated to. Let's get to it now, and I will show you how to turn this feature on within your sheets. I am now within the RAID log, which is something that I use to track action items in Smartsheet. Since Amanda and John both have action items here, and I want to keep up on the progress of these important tasks, I am going to need to come in here every once in a while and see where they're at with things. However, I don't want to dig around and try to figure out what has changed since last time. So I am going to turn on a feature that highlights the changes since I last visited this sheet. What I want to do now is look for this little highlighter where it says highlight changes towards the upper right hand corner. If I click on that, it's going to give me an option to turn it on. With that, it's going to give me additional options to let me tell the system when I want it to highlight something. So I am going to select the option towards the bottom. I want it to highlight any of the cells that have changed since I last viewed this sheet. That's not the only option here, as you see. You can highlight changes from within the last hour, today, one day, three days, seven days, 30 days, or a custom date. If you have a sheet that you and your team are doing everything within and you're working in it a lot each day, maybe you want to know what's changing each hour. However, if you are managing a lot of different sheets with a lot of different collaborators, then you may be jumping around from sheet to sheet, maybe not in each one of them every day. So for me, I really like to turn on the highlights for the last time I viewed the sheet. You also have an option on what color you want it to turn. I'm just going to go with yellow, bright yellow here. And I'm now going to exit this. This feature is turned on at this point. I have now exited this sheet and gone on about my day and have just clicked back into it. So I checked it this morning and I want to come back in and see if there have been any updates to these action items. What you'll see is that Amanda has added some comments that her action item to renew Project Management Institute contract, the application has been submitted and the invoice is arriving within the next business day. I can also see that John has completed his action item as of today and he was able to connect with Rob and confirm the shipping date and time. You will see this is so much easier to pop in, see any changes or updates that are highlighted. Okay, confirmed, I'm finished, versus coming back in and having to scan each row on my own and figure out where we're at with everything. This highlight changes feature is a time saver. And again, the way that you turn it on, look for the highlighter in the upper right hand corner where it says highlight changes, turn it on, select when you want it to highlight changes and select your color. And there you go. Thank you for viewing today. Again, I am Candace Porter and thank you for joining me on all things project management.